If you own a smartphone, you're a target of scammers using one of the oldest tricks in the book, too. Well, tonight, Jamie Tucker shows us what happens when you talk with one of those scammers behind the attack. Now, we're pretty much on to robocalls and scam emails, but scammers know that if they send us a text message nine times out of ten, we're going to click on it and read it. So smishing scams are more common than ever. Here's an example. You probably received one. A text message claiming a package cannot be delivered and is sitting in a warehouse somewhere. If you've purchased something online, you'll be tempted to tap on the link. What happens? I tapped on one to show you. It led to a website asking me to sign into my Amazon account where I could check the order. But it's a fake website, and if you enter your login information, you're giving the thief access to your account. Uh, this one took me to a fake FedEx site. Another one prompted me to sign into my Facebook account. This one didn't have a link, but a phone number. And when I called it, uh, have you ever shared your a scammer answered, kept me on the like phone, and asked me to send them a link so they could check my computer for the problem. No, no. This summer, scammers targeted iPhone users with this, claiming to be Apple support, saying there's a problem with your iCloud account, and ask iPhone users to log in to fix any problems. A link could also install malware on your computer or device, and it might be an attempt to see if your number is in service. If you respond to it, you'll get more smishing attempts. You're probably too smart to fall for these scams, but someone you know may not know about smishing and may not think they're very dangerous. And young people are especially susceptible to scams like this, so warn your kids. These scams can be costly. That's What the Tech. I'm Jamie Tucker. It's best to ignore and delete suspicious messages and set up two-factor authentication on all your accounts and devices. Good advice right there. I should do that.